just wanted to get up and say praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Amen. Uh, glad to be here with the family. Amen. And the Lord. Yes. Uh, I was telling Sister Marlo the other night that a while back I was speaking with Grandmother and Brother May here. And I was asking, you know, I've been asking like a lot of questions when reading the Bible. You know, I, 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 I do take... You know, I, I do take the literal meaning and I try to find the spiritual meaning in it, you know. And uh, and I was just trying to, you know, you know, trying to trying to get past, you know, the the, the human way of uh, of understanding things, you know, and trying to find this, you know, the truth, the spiritual meaning yeah. behind it. And uh, and though I've been finding, you know, keys and breaking down walls. And it's really increased, that the Lord has increased me. And it quickened my mind in many ways. It's spectacular. But I was reading about the garden. I was asking all these questions like, oh, I wonder where it was. I wonder if it could be found. I wonder if that tree can be found with the sword, you know, swinging back and forth. And, you know, uh, I wonder if uh, we could, if you could locate it, you know, somewhere on the map, you know. And, uh, and, and, you know, just thinking ideas like maybe it was in a parallel place, you know, that was cut off from the world. But then when I came down to it and I was just asking these questions and they were trying to explain it to me, you know, I, my mind was running in circles and I went outside and I took a deep breath and I just got the understanding of, you know, of the story of Eden. And I was like, oh my Lord, oh, yeah, I was like, Lord, it's, you know, thank you. And, you know, it's just just came to me, you know, that the whole story of Eden, it's, you know, you, it's okay to ask questions, but the <clears throat> answer to my question was, you know, what did all this mean? And I understood that it meant not to eat of the tree of good and evil, but to eat of the tree of life. Right. And the tree of life is this holy Bible that right. the Lord right. gave Amen. us, that has his truth. Yeah. And I was like, wow, as many questions as I was asking, as many wrong turns as I was taking, but the Lord directed me. And quickens your mind. And that's just amazing that, you know, that, that knowledge came in. I, you know, it's beautiful, you know? It's really beautiful when you get something like that. It's so precious. It changes you. You know, I, glory to God. Yeah. Praise the God. glory of the Lord, the Amen. truth. When you get it, you receive it. Amen. There ain't nothing like it. That's Amen. Right. It's so precious. Yeah. So amazing. And I look forward to uncovering even more. I can't stop reading this book. Amen. I used to sit around and play video games 24-7. You know, I was a big movie guy. You know, I loved to watch movies and whatnot. But since I turned my life over to the Lord and I started understanding the Word, you know, and I turned to something, I don't, you know, I may not get it right away, but I think on it, I'll search for the Scriptures hard enough, and I think enough on it, the Lord will show me what I'm looking for. Now, there's nothing in this world that can give you that. That's right. Nothing else. And there's nothing else that gives you more proof, if not more, that our God is the great I high God. I am. Yeah. Yeah. You know? That I am. It, it's, it's amazing when you have that relationship with him. It's amazing when you feel him. It's amazing when you feel him quicken you. You know? And, 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 and there is no doubt in your mind the almighty God, Jesus Christ. And he was Christ. Um, anyways, I just wanted to share that. I just want to say it's really, exi it's really exciting. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God.